Hey, Joystick News fam! Today, we're diving deep into the heart of the Pacific Northwest with a review of Pacific Drive, a game that promises a blend of atmospheric horror, driving, and a crafting experience unlike any other. Developed by Ironwood Studio and released on February 22, 2024 for PC, this game caught my eye, and I just had to share my thoughts with you all. So, buckle up as we take a road trip into the eerie world of Pacific Drive. Setting the scene. Imagine yourself in the Pacific Northwest, but this isn't your typical road trip through lush forests and along rugged coastlines. No, you're in the heart of an exclusion zone, crafted by a dubious organization known as Arda. Your companion? An old jalopy, but not just any car. This one's decked out with sci-fi baubles, a one-way radio, and a map that promises adventure at every turn. The Olympic Exclusion Zone is your playground, a place transformed into a procedurally generated world of danger and mystery. Gameplay Mechanics The Drive for Survival At its core, Pacific Drive is a roguelike crafting game that puts you behind the wheel in a fight for survival. The game's essence revolves around gathering resources to fuel your vehicle and maintain its integrity as well as your own well-being. But here's where it gets interesting the game draws inspiration from atmospheric horror giants like Alan Wake and Twin Peaks, throwing anomalies and hazards your way that feel both familiar and unsettlingly unique. Challenges and anomalies more than just a bumpy ride. From turbulent winds to the ominous shroud of darkness that blankets the landscape, the game throws a variety of obstacles at you. Environmental hazards are just the tip of the iceberg. Pseudo-sentient threats, like abductors and bubblegum buddies, add an unexpected twist to your journey, making each run a unique challenge. Crafting the heart of the experience. What I didn't expect was how much Pacific Drive leans into the crafting experience. It's not just about keeping your car running, it's about customizing your ride, reinforcing it against the myriad of threats waiting in the exclusion zone. The crafting system is deep, offering a wide range of upgrades and cosmetics to make your vehicle truly your own. However, this focus on crafting might not be everyone's cup of tea, especially if you're here for the driving experience. Final thoughts a drive worth taking. Pacific Drive offers a unique blend of genres, marrying atmospheric horror with driving and crafting in a way that's both innovative and, at times, a bit cumbersome. The game's reliance on crafting and the repetitive nature of its gameplay loop can be a double-edged sword, making it a hit or miss depending on your preferences. Personally, while I found the crafting a bit excessive at times, the thrill of navigating through the exclusion zone, coupled with the game's atmospheric charm, made it a journey worth embarking on. With a review score of 7, Pacific Drive is a solid experience for those who enjoy a mix of crafting, driving, and a touch of horror. So, Joystick News crew, what do you think? Is Pacific Drive a trip you're willing to take, or will you be steering clear of this exclusion zone? Drop your thoughts in the comments below, and if you've enjoyed this deep dive, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more gaming news and reviews. Keep those controllers charged, and I'll see you on the next adventure.